change, don't change channels. This is Pillar 3. <laughs> With a bit of difference. I'm actually fishing for a charity, cancer charity. It's, uh, Beat, beats and uh, beats and cancer charity. Uh, there's a lot of us involved in it. It's uh, the big weekend. A lot of fishermen uh, paid money. We're fishing, all wearing wigs. You'll see quite a lot of us curious people around, and that's all in need of the chat. Uh, beats, beats and charity. So <laughs> I hate it already. I wonder how women could go a bit where I long hair gets in my mouth. <laughs> Some hairs I don't mind in my mouth, but these ones I do. <laughs> I'm saying no more. Right, uh, we've come to Anstruther. Uh, I'm the one doing the fishing today. We were down here uh, two or three weeks ago and caught absolutely nothing. We were at Wormit a, a couple of weeks ago and caught one flounder. My last video was the one at uh, Riverside, but we've got, we've got seven or eight flounders like so. There we go. Uh, today we're living in hope of, uh, well I'm looking to get wrasse. Uh, I may get a pollock, may get cod, may get coal fish, uh, may get a few other smaller varieties. <laughs> Did you just roast them? Hey, look at them. Some days after your job. The weather is fine. Right. Uh, right, our bait today, well we've got mackerel, got squid, some of it's still frozen, we've got bluey, I brought sandals, just in case we could uh, give a pollock something to chase. And I've also got some nice ragworm, which is what you need if you want to catch your ras. So that's us, it's about an hour, hour and a half after high tide. I'd rather fish the tide coming in, but uh, fishing the tide going, I'm going to put an elastic band in this here, I tell you. Jesus, woman, get me a, bit, get me a hairspray. Uh, <laughs> Uh, it's about an hour, uh, just about an hour and a half after low tide, so after high tide, sorry. So we'll be fishing the tide into the low and then probably fishing a couple of hours after that. Uh, so hopefully we can catch a fish. And the weather's not too bad. It was spitting the rain as we was driving through, but it's dry here. And the wind's not too bad either, so just no sunshine. So we'll get, get baited up and get in the water and then I'll give you a look round. And I see the fairgrounds actually appeared here. I didn't think they were allowed to come out just now, but uh, looks like they'll start coming down to set up. So, oh well. Right, we'll get baited up and get in the water. Here, boys, we're going to do some casting. <laughs> As you can tell, I wasn't casting far out. You don't need to cast too far out to fish here. So, that's us in the water. Now it's just a case of drinking coffee until the fish catch. <coughs> okay, it's not big, but uh, that's what I've come for. A uh, nice wee ball and ras there. Yes. <coughs> there we go, another 
another another ras. Uh, this time a bit a bit smaller. Hopefully there's some bigger ones out there. Right, we'll give you a give you a wee look round. I've tried this before and I got a wee bite, but it never comes to nothing. Right. <coughs> We're actually on uh, Astra there, just fishing in the corner there where I like to fish. Off the Red Pier, but the lighthouse has been painted white. <laughs> so there we go. Uh, big grass area up there. There's a little wee bit of castle away up the back there. Never noticed that before. Oh. And it did and danced to other itself. The white lighthouse, the white pier, the harbour. And in the back there is shops and Houses and shops, men, chip shops, and such like. And uh, there's the showman there. I wonder if we got put up the rides. I didn't think they were allowed to actually. Oh well. Of course, the RNLI lifeboat station. Just up there. And there's a wee. Car park. It's a nice cheap car park that one. Uh, one pound twenty you can spend over four hours parking. You'll not get that price anywhere, I'll bet. I'll bet. I'll bet. You come right round the car park there, and you're onto the sea wall. And the motorway all the way around. Fishing. Sort of sitting on a, a little bit of a slope here. <coughs> but there we go. Back here, uh, the, the wind's picked up a wee bit the past wee while, and the water's gotten a wee bit rougher. I hope it doesn't keep up that, that way. I want it to calm down a wee bit. I would like it to calm down every way. But we'll, we'll see how things go. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's a beauty. Well done. We've got to show what the hell it is. All that weight in there. <laughs> there we go. There's something I don't catch every day. Oh, wait a minute. It's a... Oh, what do you call that thing? Three. Oh. God almighty. Anyway, it's one, <laughs> one of the long dog? fish with three. Wow, oh, what you call that? Oh, in the name of God. A new? No, uh, it's a uh, three. <laughs> That's it. The three bearded rock one. And quite a sizable one as well, actually. Right, that's it. We're gonna gonna weigh this little sod. I don't know. I don't know what the record is for this or any any kind of weight. But uh, oh, right, catch catch for cancer. Yay! But then, put the mullet bag here. Let's see if I can even ring up. It's two. Two hundred and s don't know if you can see that or not. Two hundred and seventy grams. 
Yeah, 270 gram. That's quite a weight. That's bigger than my Rasa earlier. 